Hi Ling fam, I hope you're doing well. I prepared a video today about Negan and it is an anti-block punishment guide with Ling Xiaoyu. I know that sometimes it can feel very complicated to learn all the moves and how to punish them properly, but this time it's not so complicated and I will start by explaining you why. So, in a nutshell, Negan has a total of 33 punishable moves, 12 of them are punishable with wild standing, and it can be either lows or mids, forcing you into crutch. Anyways, 11 of these 12 moves are punishable with wild standing 4. The only exception being the lows that you are seeing now, that Negan has access to only when you are on the ground, and it's lunch punishable now. You can easily recognize a lot of specific moves that are lunch punishable such as Rage, Power Crush, the only move where Lucille is switching hand, the only string finishing by a front kick, the only attack where Negan walks backward or attacks you with a knife. So you already know how to punish 18 of Negan's moves and almost 100% of the remaining ones are with Lucille. I hope that this will help you to memorize all these moves and I will let you have a closer look at all of them. The three moves that you will see now are ending with the same animation and share the same issue regarding pushback. I strongly advise you to punish it with three even so done forward 2 one is working as well, but three will avoid you some trouble since it has a higher range. As you can see here, you can use forward forward 2 1 to punish when you are at a higher range, but it will not reach at max range. So, the only option that you will have at max range to punish your opponent is forward forward 3, but you need to do it very early and very fast. Mm -hmm. 